Hey everybody, one of we's here at 416 in the morning and I am stoked for this one. At E3 we got the reveal of Wolfgang, we've got some gameplay, we got the toy figure, uh, illustration, screenshots, all the good stuff. Uh, that said, no better time than now to join the Skylander Club forum, skylanderclub.com. I built it, I run it, I made it for people like you. That's uh, not some third party deal, we're also on Twitter, check it out. If you like what you see, sign up. I would love to have you join us. Now, Skylanders Imaginators, we got our official release two weeks ago. We've been teased and leaked a few things, and now at E3, we're getting into some more action. So, uh, Wolfgang is amazing. He is an undead element bow slinger. His slogan, Let There Be Rock, quick little rundown. After being captured by the Trap Masters, the former supervillain realized that he could earn more respect as a sensei than he ever could as a musician. More on his bio here in a little bit, but here is his illustration. A big fan of these pictures. I wanted the physical toys for the villains when I was at E3 between Swap Force and Trap Team. I was that guy that was like, why don't we just get villain figures? That would be epic. Wolfgang wasn't always a werewolf. He was once a handsome, brilliant musician set to marry a beautiful princess. Before the wedding, he planned to unveil his ultimate symphony to all the greatest music aficionados in Skylands. Convinced they would love it and instantly hail him as the best composer ever. Uh, if you played the future of Skylands, you get a good feel for Wolfgang, my favorite Doom Raider by far. But they didn't. They hated it. And even worse, it actually hurt to listen to. Uh, he had unintentionally discovered the musical note for pain. Being shunned like this drove Wolfgang utterly and completely mad, physically transforming him into the werewolf that he is today. So a little bit of a tragedy, a little bit of a romance turned tragedy if you will here, but we're not done. Uh, with the princess no longer wanting to marry him, he turned to a life of crime, terrorizing the royal subjects and using his evil music as a weapon. The Golden Queen took note of this and realized that Wolfgang could make a powerful ally if she could control his rage and keep him in line. You'll recall there were a few scenes where he kind of started to question the Golden Queen's rules, so you have to wonder what the Doom Raiders would have been like with him at the helm. But when they were both captured by the Trap Masters, Eon gave these two supervillains a choice. Either go back to a newly reformed Cloudcracker prison, or become Skylander senseis, teaching a new generation of Imaginators their formidable battle skills, as well as how to stay clear of a life of crime. The villain battle, the boss battle with Wolfgang, one of my favorite to date in the franchise. They accepted the deal, but first had to prove themselves by rearranging all the books in the Academy Academy's library, a task which took almost two years, and they customized this here, it's not just your typical run in the middle with Golden Queen, almost driving Wolfgang mad again. But he got through it and realized he could earn more respect as a sensei training the Bowslinger class than he ever could as a musician. So we got his bio, we got the slogan, you got the rundown, you know how I feel about him. There's a reason this man is featured on some of my channel art, you know, so uh, the illustrations, I absolutely love them. A lot of people omit that stuff. I'm gonna do something different with the uh, video here at the start, but uh, this is the standard form. Keep in mind there is a dark edition. Uh, I will be going that route, no doubt. It is a great bang for the buck in my opinion. Looks great in this form. Note the skull, note the detail on the arrows. I can't wait to see it in hand. This is screenshot number one. This is a serious contender for my Twitch background, <laughs> probably. Uh, possibly Twitter. Uh, I don't know. I've considered running some contests. I've had, you know, Kamek or Magic Koopa for forever. But uh, right here, this is a second shot, and I love that freaking wasp. I don't know if it's a wasp or a hornet or an owl acid insect of stinginess i don't know what it is but it's amazing i'm gonna do something different with the video here we're gonna break it down with screenshots then we'll go in you got the classic slide you got the skulls in it. And very cool singular bow shots he seems to be able to rapid fire look at that he does a the harp into the ground and then look we get these little gravestone amp speaker sets and he starts strumming on them. There's radial damage. This is an amazing to try it. And then there's a grand finale. Note Wolfgang aggressively leaping into the air, smashes down, 
game set match. Now this is a beautiful level design. The visuals have been super impressive here early on. Check this out though. If I was playing this at E3, one of Weezem would have gone left when everyone else went right. That's correct. Uh, I impressed some of the demo people like, you're the first person that went that way. It's like, well yes, I explore. That said, his move sets are just amazing. Uh, note the skull right there. I highlighted it once more for you. It's freaking fantastic. Right here, he slammed the harp down in a different manner. There's two points of impact. Once again, you've got sort of the coffin speakers. These are radio damage. Uh, very interesting stuff. Now, what I'm going to do, just because some of you probably hated that, you're going to see the whole thing again with no interruption. So you got this sort of like dragonflies. I love the slide of that. Uh, the rapid firing of the arrows is unexpected. I want to know if this and the uh, linear, you know, coffins are on the same path. If they are, holy freaking man, this is why we play the game, folks. Uh, we're coming in here. I also want to stress, I didn't mention this in the uh, previous gameplay video. This reminds me a lot of, like, uh, you know, classic Donkey Kong stuff. So I don't know if that's what it is. No Eruptor. Again, these wasps, I want to know more about them. I hope they do the end. Wolfgang looks freaking amazing. I'm getting standard and dark. I'm going to have wolf paths at all times. Uh, fantastic Doom Raider, my favorite one. Uh, I think he steals the show. Everyone was all on the Peñata bandwagon, and I was that guy that was like, no, Wolfgang. That said, Skylander Club, we've got the Imaginator section. Check it out. You can become a Scholar of Wisdom. Leave a comment. I am a Scholar of Wisdom. Let me know your favorite thing to watch on the channel or what brought you to the channel and for bragging rights how long you've been watching. Now, a bonus brick in the wall will be hashtag let there be rock. That is the slogan for Wolfgang. Again, the wall of wisdom, you can find more information in the video description box. It is in my Wisdom Plays Minecraft series. So let me know your thoughts on Wolfgang. You know where I stand in the battle. But uh, I am stoked for this guy. I will probably, since there wasn't the whole Link thing, I'll probably be pre-ordering the Dark Edition. Uh, on the Xbox One, I would imagine, might change things up. We'll see if there's any other tricks up their sleeve. But so, uh, I'm stoked for this guy. I'm in absolutely thrilled. There's two versions. I wish we would have had this in Trap Team. But uh, I can't complain. The toy looks fantastic. The gameplay is super impressive. Uh, it's 4:24 a.m. and I am wired because of that. So let me know your thoughts. I'll catch you back here for more Skylanders Imaginators action.